When the mRNA is complete, it snakes out of the nucleus into the cytosol. Then, in a dazzling display of choreography, all the components of a molecular machine lock together around the RNA to form a miniature factory called a ribosome. It translates the genetic information in the RNA into a string of amino acids that will become a protein. tRNA molecules, the green triangles, bring each amino acid to the ribosome. The amino acids are the small red tips attached to the tRNAs. There are different tRNAs for each of the 20 amino acids, each of them carrying a three-letter nucleotide code that is matched to the mRNA in the machine. Now we come to the heart of the process. Inside the ribosome, the mRNA is pulled through like a tape. The code for each amino acid is read off, three letters at a time, and matched to the three corresponding letters on the tRNAs. When the right tRNA plugs in, the amino acid it carries is added to the growing protein chain. You are watching the process in real time. After a few seconds, the assembled protein starts to emerge from the ribosome. Ribosomes can make any kind of protein. It just depends on what genetic message you feed in on the mRNA. In this case, the end product is hemoglobin. The cells in our bone marrow churn out 100 trillion molecules of it per second. And as a result, our muscles, brain, and all the vital organs in our body receive the oxygen they need.